from the Galapagos Islands. Located 600 miles off the coast of Ecuador, these islands are home to a wide variety of flora and fauna. And among those inhabitants are the sea lions. Extremely social animals, they gather on the shores in groups of 20 to 30 individuals. However, life isn't just about sunbathing. Each day brings its own struggles. Males must compete for mates and territory. The larger males can hold even greater areas, forming harems of up to 25 to 30 females. However, these males can't hunt while they defend their territory, so they slowly starve until a new male comes to take over. Those who can't get a territory congregate into bachelor colonies until they're strong enough to find mates. And the females, for their part, take turns watching over the pups of the colony. And the rest go on extended hunting trips, usually within 15 kilometers of the shores. Although their diet mainly consists of fish, octopus, and crustaceans, they will at times go for other prey. But penguins tend to be a little too tough to catch. And aside from their daily struggles, there are other dangers they face giving them their threatened status. Every few years, a phenomenon of El Nino brings warm, nutrient-poor water to the Galapagos, making food scarce. And aside from the climate, there are also humans steadily encroaching on marine habitats. And curious pups are at danger of getting caught in fishing nets cast out throughout the islands. Fortunately, their biggest threats are behind them. Although nowhere near their peak, their population has stopped declining in the 21st century since the Galapagos sea lion can no longer be hunted. And because of that, they can still be seen lying among the rocks, taking in the sun, or playing with their pups all throughout the Galapagos. Thank you.